Hey everyone, so for those of you who do not know me, my name is Megan Leslie. I am a bigger competitor with the CPA, so the CPA is the Canadian Physique Alliance. I currently live in Toronto, Ontario. I am getting ready for my third show. The first show I did was bikini, second was figure, then I took a nice long off season, and now I'm doing my third figure show, or technically my second figure show, but my third show in general. This whole series is a vlogging series of what prep is like. I really wanted to do an entire series just so that people can see what it's like to prep for a show. It's not easy, it's not glamorous, even though those girls look damn good on stage, and we're all like, makeup and tan and our bikinis but it is not as glamorous as people think it's really hard work and so i wanted to showcase you know what it's like to actually get ready for a show so that people could actually kind of understand what it's like this video is going to be two different things it's going to be a catch-up video and it's going to be a holiday video right now i am nine weeks out from my show and i have been prepping now for eight weeks initially i wanted to start vlogging right from the beginning and i did i had so much content right at the beginning um but the first five weeks of my prep I got sick twice and so I was just feeling so under the weather and I had exams so I was extremely overwhelmed so I didn't even get the chance to really film I had a little bit of content but really not that much so what I'm gonna do in this video is I'm gonna just catch you up a little bit on how the first five weeks of my prep went and what I did and then the rest of the video is going to be Christmas and New Year's because I prepped obviously during the Christmas holidays from now on I am doing a video a week until my show and then you guys will see my show I'm gonna vlog obviously at my show and stuff. Okay, so how did the first five weeks of my prep go? What did I do? What have I done so far to manipulate my diet my cardio my workouts, etc, etc When I first started I started on a high-fat diet my coach switched me to five days of eating high fat and two days of eating high carbs. I don't really know what my macros were like. I was still eating like 2,300 calories, something around there. So really high calories still. It worked, I lost weight pretty quickly. So while I was on this high fat diet and the carbs, I also started a strength training phase program for five weeks. I was at the gym four days a week and I was off for three, which was odd to me like i was like that is so much rest i'm so used to going six days a week but he was like nope you're gonna need the rest and he was right i needed the rest for sure because what happened each week so week one i started with six sets and then of every single exercise and then as we progressed it was like seven eight nine sets so it kept like the volume kept getting higher and my reps were anywhere between five and twelve somewhere in that range so I definitely needed the rest and it was really beneficial because I am stronger now that I went through that strength training phase okay so that was the first five weeks and then when I hit five weeks everything switched up again and so in terms of my diet I went from a high fat diet and now I am on just eating carbs no fat at all like a high carb diet initially the plan at five weeks was to go four days um, high carbs and then three days high fat just so that I could cycle in my carbs but my coach was like you're looking really flat unfortunately and my muscles aren't very full so we decided to just do carbs and so I'm eating strictly a like high carb diet not really high carb but I mean carbs now like every day which I love because I love carbs so in terms of my training at five weeks I went back to your basic hypertrophy training style program so I'm doing more frequency so i'm hitting more muscle groups multiple times a week and my reps vary anywhere between 15 and like 36 reps maybe 12 is the least that i do um which i love it gives you more of a pump which i literally am always chasing the pump <laughs> it's like my favorite thing to do in the gym in terms of weight when i started prep i was 152 that's where i started and then as of two days ago weigh 141 pounds so my weight has dropped pretty significantly and that happened actually a lot in the first little while of switching up my diet i don't really measure my progress by the scale as much neither does and neither does my coach we've been taking body fat percentages because they're a little bit better and that's really what you care about especially when you're on stage like how lean are you really what does your weight matter i started at 18 17 18 percent body fat and now i am at about 12 or 13 so somewhere around there so things are moving along really really well i'm still pretty far out for my show i still have nine weeks to go we'll see how the nine weeks go so this is what i look like when i started prep 
and this is what I look like as of this morning. Bit of a difference. <laughs> so these first couple of weeks have been fine in terms of energy, like I'm still feeling good. I'm still feeling strong, which is awesome because a lot of times when you compete, the strength goes down really quickly, but I'm still feeling strong um, in terms of what I'm capable of lifting, so that's really good. I've kind of woke up with some bad headaches within the last week. I wake up with these like massive migraines, um, but I'm sure they'll go away. It's not a big deal. Maybe it's just the weather. It could be the weather here in Toronto. This weather sucks and it's cold. I hate the cold. But anyways, <laughs> okay, that is definitely enough rambling for right now. Hopefully you guys are all caught up on what it's been like thus far. Like I said, I'm going to continue to let you guys in on what I'm doing and how I'm manipulating my diet. Keep watching and you guys can find out the workouts that I did for the holiday season. Today is December 24th. It is Christmas Eve. So I haven't been able to really enjoy any holiday treats or anything like that uh, thus far on prep, obviously. I've been very clean. But my coach decided that he didn't want to be a Grinch and he said that I'm doing so well and I'm getting so lean so quickly that I get to have a cheat meal. Um, he said it didn't really matter when it kind of happened. I could do it um, on Christmas Eve, Christmas, whenever I kind of wanted to. So I'm Italian and we do a big shrimp dinner on Christmas Eve. It is like my favorite meal of the entire year. So I decided that I'm going to do Christmas Eve cheat meal dinner with my family. So I'm very excited about it. I did a chest and back shoulder workout earlier today at the gym. I figured, you know, I'm going to hit some muscles that I need to kind of work on so that all of the extra food that I'm eating will go to those muscles hopefully. In terms of diet today, I've only eaten protein. I've eaten protein all day long. I had protein for breakfast with vegetables. Post work, pre-workout I had actually a little bit of carbs. I had an apple at least so then I have some energy to lift. And then post-workout I had two scoops of whey with some vegetables. And now I'm gonna have my cheat meal and I'm so excited. Yeah, I'm gonna show you guys. My mom is in the kitchen. So I'm gonna show you guys what it looks like and then I'll show you the finished product. I'll turn all these lights off before I leave the room. And we've got the Christmas music playing. And my mom's sleeping away in the kitchen. Say hi. Hi. <laughs> And there's our shrimp, it's cooking away. Yes, you ready to look at it? Ready? Okay, let's look at it. Boom! Doesn't that look so good? Even if it doesn't look good, I can promise you that it tastes really good. <laughs> so that's all that matters. And then, even though I'm technically only supposed to have a cheap meal, I'm gonna include dessert in that, so we have like a really awesome cake. And then a whole bunch of goodies, which I'm really excited about. So dinner has been served, and this is what it looks like, guys. What a beauty. Yo, we need to get you an actual tripod. Delicious. I know, I need a real tripod. And because I cannot drink alcohol, nor do I really want to because I'm not a big drinker anyways, I drink Zevia. My mom is so kindly pouring it for me into my big-ass glass. Here, let me see. So this, this is the root beer flavored. So I'm gonna have that. And then it's in this nice glass. Good stuff. And that is all I'm vlogging for you guys today. Tomorrow, I am back on my diet. <laughs> and nothing too crazy. And I go to the gym tomorrow, so that's fun. My sister was driving this car. I can tell because I can't reach this thing. Ugh. And the steering wheel is so freaking high. Oh my gosh. What is going on, everyone? It is December 25th, so it is Christmas. Merry Christmas. Currently, I am on my way to the gym. I'm about to go hit a leg day, which is good considering I had a cheat meal last night. So I can use those uh, calories, put them to good use, because it's a big muscle group. So I'm currently on my way to pick up Reese so that we can go to the gym together. We had a really good day. We've got some high rep stuff. I'm gonna record some of our workout today, so 
That should be good. It's like, Reese is like the worst person at like, not being ready for the gym when I tell him that I'm gonna be here. So I gave him an extra couple minutes today. Let's see if he's ready for the gym by the time that I got here. Let's see. Is this where you ran to the gym? Yeah. He's ready for the gym today. Good stuff. <laughs> so I just got to the gym. I'm just warming up. So right now with my prep, I currently do 20 minutes of a uh, hit prior to my workout. I've never done it, like my other two preps, I've never done it prior to my workout. I always do it after. Right now it's okay, like I can do it before. You guys have the energy. But as I get closer to my show, it'll probably end up being after I lift just so that I have the energy to actually lift. Yeah, so right now I'm just on the Stairmaster. I love the Stairmaster. Gets my heart rate up super fast. Like I'm ready. I'm ready like panting. And my arm really hurts from holding this camera up for so long. Um, so I'll go on here. I do 30 seconds fast, 30 seconds slow, something like that. And then I will lift currently. I'm wearing a red shirt for Christmas. I, I don't own that many red workout items, so I just went with a red shirt to go with the theme of Christmas. Listen, I'm gonna tie my hair up right now, and then I will record my workout so you guys can try it out one time. It'll probably be killer because my coach, all of his workouts kill me. I love it. Um. Day. He's only on set three. Why are you so tired today? Come on, get up. It's Christmas. Exactly. You, should be here. you should be working off all the calories you probably um. ate yesterday. You were good? I wasn't. Um. January 2nd. Happy New Year, everybody. I am currently off to the gym now to hit <clears throat> shoulders. Um, I was supposed to go to the gym yesterday and do a New Year's Day workout and record it for you guys. It's still gonna be shoulders, but I woke up with like a massive headache and I just felt like absolute garbage. I don't even know why, but um, yeah, I felt like crap, so I decided that I was going to just not go to the gym. I have two rest days to spare during the week, so I decided that I was just going to take one of my rest days, even though I took one of my rest days on Sunday. I decided just to take another one. It's not a big deal. I'll just go to the gym every day for the rest of the week. <sighs> Can you see that? <sighs> Breezy in Toronto today. The temperature was so nice like 
for the entire holiday season. It didn't snow, and then bam, it's like minus eight, probably more with the wind chill today. So I'm freezing, which is awful. I literally hate getting lean as the weather gets colder. It sucks. I like I went to a Buffalo Bills game on Sunday for the last game of the season so I could watch my team the Miami Dolphins play and it was it was cold but it wasn't freezing but it literally took me so long to get warm again because I'm so lean and it freaking sucked so anyways I'm gonna go grab Reese and we're gonna go to the gym caught up now you know exactly what the first eight weeks of my prep kind of look like and now you'll see continuing on like I said week by week so I will see you guys next week